Hello everyone and welcome back to Free Space. We Beaks here. Um I've been a bit ill, as you can probably tell in my voice, uh, which is why I haven't done any videos over the past week. Um I'm still not feeling a hundred percent, but um well, I can't uh, just just leave it now. Uh so I'm gonna do some free space. I haven't done any of this for a while. Just get this lead to come around the back. Here we go. Um, so I had to whack out the old joystick which has already accumulated dust since I last used it because I haven't been playing Battlefield 3 either so um, you know no uh, joystick use from that right let's get this done in the last episode the uh, our alliance with the Vasudans found that subspace portal um, so let's go and uh, hear what the man has to say. I know these briefings are a bit long. Um, With the Gamma Draconis system secure, a task force... But they provide some the vital information. I'm going to sneeze in a minute, so I'm just going to mute the mic. At this point, the scientists have ruled out the possibility the device is of Shivan origin. Dr. Mina Hargrove, leader of the research team, has issued a report of its preliminary findings. An excerpt of this report follows the subspace portal is unlike any Shivan construction we have yet encountered though Shivans demonstrate considerable diversity as a species all Shivan technology possesses certain distinctive properties none is present in the subspace device which means we must look elsewhere for the portals origin we do know that the device is very very old on the order of several thousand years so, another species, then, by the sounds of it, or by the looks of it, or very ancient device created by the Shivans, and they've changed the way they are. Possible. The field generated oh, by the interlocking movement of the portal's components creates a subspace vortex, connecting one part of the universe to another. Dr. Hargrove theorizes that whoever built this device they have used it to stabilize a jump node on the verge of collapse. Oh. Dr. Hargrove is correct. This technology is a tremendous discovery. Why? By constructing our own portal, we might be able to reopen the soul jump node in oh. Delta Serpentis. Since the destruction of the Lucifer caused the node to collapse 32 years ago, Earth has remained isolated from the GTVA. We might also be able to stabilize subspace nodes that are currently too volatile for travel, thus creating routes to systems previously unexplored. Our military operation will focus on what lies on the other side of the subspace portal. Let's determine where the node leads, the extent of the Shivan presence there. Above all, Sounds like a bad idea. we must prevent the Shivans from returning to Gamma Draconis. Because the portal will remain active while the research team studies the technology, our systems are vulnerable to attack. Allied Command has deemed this an acceptable risk given the potential benefits. Do we really want to start flying through unknown territory in the search when we're already fighting a war against the Shivans, quite frankly? At 1540 hours, the GTD Aquitaine entered the subspace portal in Gamma Draconis and jumped to our current position. We have entered a nebula, a vast and dense ionized field, and possibly the remnant of a supernova. We have traveled farther than any Terrans in the history of subspace travel. Oh no. The nebula has severely limited the Aquitaine's long-range sensors. We are deploying our fighter wings to explore the immediate vicinity and determine the extent of the enemy presence. Each fighter squadron will deploy a flight of four wings. Alpha, Zeta, Iota, and Kappa will patrol a series of four waypoints. Zeta Wing will lead this sortie, so follow Zeta-1 and do not stray. Be advised the nebula could interfere with your onboard systems. The ionized field will compromise your sensors, even within combat range. Oh, crikey. Um, pr I, pretty I don't think I remember anything from this mission now. <coughs> um, but it just sounds bad. I mean... Don't you guys think as well? Who wants to go flying into unknown space, a nebula at that, 
to go and discover enemy presence and if there is I can't remember if there is a another race you know from all the experience and other things you very rarely do um, things get off to cozy starts do they everything just ends up shooting each other um, so wing. You are clear to take off. <sighs> funny sounding man Apple wing you have clearance Zeta wing go I've forgotten the controls there we go Alpha wing go funny sounding man there never mind I want to target this guy and do control. Oh, it's Alt M, you muffin. Jesus. I'm such a retard. Alpha, form up on Zeta. Follow Zeta 1's lead to the waypoints. Okay, Alpha, target my fighter and try to keep up. Boost your engine power and be ready to hit your burns because we're going to get through this one fast and clean. Good luck, pilots. Keep a tight formation and look out for each other. Let's all get home alive. Yeah. Let's. At least let's try. I'm going to have to try and reacquaint my ex's countermeasures. Yes. How are we supposed to get a visual confirmation? I can't see a thing in this mess. Good point. Rather be fighting the NTF if you ask me. I never signed on for hunting Sheevans. Oh, I don't know why don't you'd want yourself. to. We're the ones being hunted, pilot. Oh, Command should shut down that portal and send the Aquitaine back to Deneb. We've got no business being out here. If Command needs your opinion, they'll promote you to Admiral. Now <laughs> shut up and focus. Chain of Command. Remember your places, people. Man, my nose is so itchy. I'm gonna sneeze. Report in. This is IOTA-1. Sensors are picking up Zilch, Command. We're flying blind out here. Well, it is a nebula. Alpha-2 here. Nothing to report. This is Zeta-1, all clear. I can see them on my radar as they're getting further away. The green dots get darker and they Cabo start... Wing, what's your status? Over. Oh, we've lost contact, have we? Kappa Wing, this is Allied Command. Please respond. God, it's already gone down the shitter. You barely even started. Iota Wing, investigate Kappa's last waypoint. The ionized field is interfering with our transmission. Just doesn't sound good to me. If you want double missiles, you have to press shift. Yeah. Okay. So, because you know, you remember the stuff. Secondary weapons set to normal fire mode. Let's see what uh, Iota Wing come back with. I don't know, it just doesn't feel right, people, does it? not feel right at all. I just realised this game does not fit on my screen perfectly. It's actually push we got a red dot on our radar. On sensors. I can't get a lock. Oh, looks Hostile like targets confirmed. A wing of mana cores closing fast. <laughs> Speed up, man. These things are fast. Nice. It's one down. I need to change the sunny different. Objective neutralized. Need to find All bandits Zeta are down, one. Command. There we go. Area secure. Find this guy. Resume your patrol, pilots. Good. That went well. Considering. There's gotta be a base or ore destroyer in this nebula somewhere. Yeah. Those spiders couldn't survive out here on their own. They don't just float this around. This nebula could be 10 or 20 light years in diameter. Finding a single ship would be impossible. Unless the Sheevans find us first. Do we have a status update on Kappa Wing? Gone, Negative. obviously. No word from Kappa yet. We'll find out in debriefing. A whole flight gone. More hostiles, or at least on the radar. Hostile indicators on radar. Let's go. Oh, God, 
these things can turn much higher than I can. And they're faster as well, I think. Look at that, chewing him up. Lovely, long range shot. Get off my friend. Shit, one's down already. Dodge that one. We lost one by the sounds of it. Which is not so good. Okay, let's get back on patrol. Alpha, Sorry for the sniffling, leading. everyone. Uh, oh, Alpha must be my squad. Yeah, I forgot. Never mind. You can't expect to keep everyone alive throughout the whole thing. I like how everyone's upside down. Because you know, in space, there's no right way up. What is that? Some debris. Some more. Hmm. I have a bad feeling about this. Something went down here. I mean, it's not just debris floating around. Every floating. But there's more there floating around for no reason. <coughs> We've got a purple signature now on the on the old radar. Hold on. I got a visual on something big. A cruiser or a corvette. Do you recognize the configuration? Is it a Rakshasa no, or a is that? Negative command, it's a Terran cruiser, Fenris class. There's no Allied ship authorized in your vicinity. Hail them, pilot. This is Zeta Wing of the 107th Ravens, GTD Aquitaine. Please identify yourself. This is Captain Arthur Romeg of the GTC Trinity. We have sustained heavy damage and our jump drive is inoperative. We need immediate assistance. Yeah. Your designation is incorrect, Romeg. Your ship defected to the NTF 10 days ago. You have been stripped of your rank and citizenship in the GTVA. Surrender the Trinity or be destroyed. As captain of the NTC Trinity, I surrender on the condition you get us the hell out of here. What's your status? We repelled a Shivan attack, but engines sustained critical damage. I powered down non-essential systems so the Shivans wouldn't detect us. We've been drifting ever since. What's your assessment of the damage? Some components were destroyed in the attack, but my chief engineer thinks a field repair is possible. We will send a damage control team with the necessary components. Transmit your diagnostics. Transmitting now. <sighs> oh dear. What were you doing out here, Romic? As a prisoner of war, my rights are protected under the Beta Aquilae Convention. I will answer no questions, Command. I thought Rebels didn't recognize Beta. Oh, no, no but do. we do, Pilot. Damage control ah. has been deployed. They should be arriving momentarily. No, it's E4. So we've got to escort this guy to the ship, make sure he does all the jolly good Discovery stuff. Discovery here, initiating docking procedure. Watch our backs, little friends. Heads up, enemy wing closing in. Uh oh. So I need to stop them. From Hit it! The hell? They're just too fast for me. That's one down. Okay, we want 
train too Prepare far. Prepare to be boarded, Trinity. Trinity standing by. Docking point secure. Okay, Romig, we're taking you and your crew into custody. Follow the drill and no one gets hurt. Enemies by the sounds of the music. More hostiles incoming. Mm -hmm. Where? Keep the Shevens away from the Trinity pilots. That ship won't survive another attack. Give us a time estimate, Discovery. We can jury rig a solution in 15 minutes, Command. 15 minutes. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, something took that out fast. Fighter turrets online. Negative. We need all power on engines. Great. You could really use those. Almost flew to them. You need to buy us more time, pilot. Going as fast as we can. I know what I can do. Where's the Trinity? C. All fighters. Roger Protect that. my target. There we go. <coughs> I should just stop them straying too far. You can see where it's been hit by something. They're spawning up there or more bombers. Oh these ones look Heads up, enemy wing closing in. These ones look sprightly, don't they? I'm never gonna catch these. I'm gonna be here for so long. Look how easy they turn. Oh. There we go. I'm never going to catch him. Trinity is getting absolutely. We can't hold him back forever, Trinity. Hurry up with those repairs. It's getting absolutely annihilated, but I can't. Ah! Oh, it blew up, you see. We've lost the Trinity. All wings return to base. We're aborting this mission. Data wing here. We're bugging out. Uh oh, I have a feeling I'm gonna have to do this again. confronted an overwhelming Sheevan force in a hostile environment. Under these circumstances, there was nothing you or anyone else could have uh. done to save the Trinity and our boarding party. You were lucky to survive this sortie, pilot. We have heard nothing from Kappa Wings since they vanished from our sensors. Unfortunately, we must presume the worst. They will be listed MIA unless we find evidence to the contrary. Our search parties have found no trace of these fighters. The presence of the Trinity deepens the enigma of the NTF's secret agenda. What was the Trinity doing out here? And what does Bosch know about the subspace portal? All patrols have uncovered an extensive Sheevan force in the nebula. Command will deploy more warships through the subspace portal to assist with our mission of exploration and containment. IOTA and Epsilon wings encountered two Sheevan cruisers near our current location. No. When our reinforcements arrive, we will move against them. Sounds fun. Uh oh. That's 32 cutscene. years ago on the Altair system, Vesudan scientists discovered the remnants of an extinct civilization we now call the Ancients. And here we found the secret to defeating the Shivans. How close did we come to being a footnote in the history of a future species? that would happen upon our ruins 10,000 years from now. Would they indulge in the fiction of their own immortality until the Sheevans came for them? And how long had this gone on? Did the ancients stumble upon the monoliths 
and the tombs of their predecessors in this distant corner of space, dismissing the warnings carved in the walls of the sepulchre. And when the destroyers came at last, what did the ancients think as they sifted the cremation of dust and bones, staring into the mute remains for a key? Some solution to their plight. What if there had been countless races, stretching back into infinity, and like the nine cities of Troy, each civilization had been built on the rubble of one that came before, each annihilated by the Shevans. The ancients died 8,000 years ago. As humanity emerged from its Neolithic infancy, they believed their voyage across the sea of stars woke the dragon that slept beneath the waves. That the Shevans were birthed from the flux of subspace, and their destruction was the revenge of an angry cosmos. With recent victories on the Civil War front, the GTVA Security Council has authorized the deployment of two Dimos-class corvettes into the Nebular Theater of Operations. The Lysander and the Actium crossed the subspace portal in Gamma Draconis at 2335 hours and joined up with the Aquitaine's battle group. I don't know if you saw that cutscene, because perhaps the thing wasn't uh, there during it, but it was just, um, I think it was Bosch, you know, the NTF leader just talking about how the subspace port was actually designed by a race called the Ancients who came before humanity in space like they died out 8,000 years before this game is set um, they were wiped out by the Sheevans apparently so everyone's been wiped out by the Sheevans it's just like a cycle everyone keeps getting killed by the Sheevans so Oh dear. On their last sortie, Epsilon and Iota Wings encountered two Shivan warships. A Rakshasa-class cruiser designated the Iblis, and a Lilith-class cruiser designated the Azuras. Admiral Petrock has instructed our corvettes to hunt down and destroy these vessels. The 107th will provide fighter cover. Okay. Alpha Wing, your mission is to escort the Lysander and the Actium as they carry out this assault. Your first priority will be to eliminate all hostile fighters and bombers. Only then will you assist the corvettes with their strike against the Shivan warships. If we lose either corvette, you will abort the mission and withdraw from the field immediately. I have a feeling this is going to be quite difficult. So we've got, what's this? Hornet swarms. Two hornet swarms. I suppose it's fine. And Prometheus. And Prometheus. Okay. Steady as she goes. Those cruisers are somewhere in this vicinity. We're now converging on their last known position. Okay. Are you reading anything on sensors, Actium? Negative, Lysander. Oh, I've pressed F2. <laughs> Uh, wings, beta, if we don't defend find them, the find Actium. Us. I don't expect we'll be disappointed. Roger that. The Shivans fought Alpha. nothing but great war relics. We'll show them what firepower defend. is all about. Affirmative. Defend he Lysander. So that way we can, uh... I'm picking know, up something. A wing of enemy fighters closing in. Alpha and beta, intercept those bandits. Keep them off the Lysander and Actium. But we've got uh, some efficient anti-air abilities now because, well, they. I don't think there are any bombers, they're just fighters, but that's fine. Getting a bit beat up by my own uh, anti-air there, but that's fine. Such is life. Which way are we going? This way. <coughs> Take a little bit of damage. To be expected, I suppose. Let's get a closer look at these ships. A Kane class cruiser now coming into view. So we gotta destroy it. Confirmed. Confirmed. 
Sure.